celebrate. Doctors giving him some great news about his battle against cancer. I talked with him today. Andretti is back at his happy place, working with his son Jarrett, getting ready to go racing again. It gives me a lot of energy. It makes me feel good. I love to get to the racetrack and um, smell the methanol and, and see Jarrett drive and, and run these sprint cars. Andretti underwent surgery last month to remove his spleen and gallbladder after he was diagnosed with cancer that had spread from his colon. I went in a week after my surgery and they basically said, we don't need to see you for maybe about another three weeks. Scheduled the next appointment, said we're going to scan you then. Until then, you know, no chemo. Um, you're a free man. He's free until the end of the month when chemo kicks in again. But right now he appreciates every day of good health. Actually feeling more like a human again. And, you know, you, you start losing that chemo, all the chemo things that go along with it. They Not only the side effects, but... You know, just the way you feel and everything. Back in May, Andretti shared his cancer battle with me right here on Channel 13, encouraging men over 50 to get colonoscopy. I have so many wives that come up to me and thank me because it got them to be able to push their husband to get colonoscopies that, that weren't going to do it. And, and people like that, I mean, just to hear the stories. Andretti is a fighter. He's not done playing race cars or getting the word out about the silent killer colon cancer. I've had a great life. I've had so many good things happen to me. I have a great family. I got nothing to complain about. Nothing. And, you know, but you look at it and I go to the infusion center and you were there with me and I'm the youngest guy there. So you sit there and go, what did I do wrong? And what can other people do to avoid this? And John says it's pretty simple. Everyone over 50, go get a colonoscopy. Don't wait. My brother's 57. He waited, had to have surgery last week. He's going to be a okay, though. Mm -hmm. well, he's a lucky one. We're glad about that. Yeah. And John looks pretty he's looking good. Pretty looks good. The diagnosis is looking pretty good. Yeah. yeah. He, he saved so again. many lives. Yeah. Thanks, Thank you, Dave.